Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Honestly, it means the world to me that you're tuning in, watching the content, watching the videos. So everybody who's watching, thank you so much. So this trick, guys, I'm about to show you. It is mind-blowing. It's super easy to do and you will fool your friends and family. So with that being said, let's get into it. Okay, so here is the performance, guys, of this effect. This trick, guys, honestly, this trick is so good. I love this. So to start off with, we do need a random card. This card is not the selection, okay? This black free of spades is going to help me locate the selected card in just a second. So keep your eye on the free. That's going in, just like so. And you're going to dribble the card, and the spectator is going to shout the word stop. So they'll shout stop. They're going to look at the card, and remember, I'm not going to look at the card, so hopefully you guys can see the card. It's going to go inside the center, just like so, and give them a quick cut and a mix. And one cut for luck, okay? And you can see that the card is somewhere in the center as well, and we'll give them one quick cut again. And to find the selection card, what we're going to do is divide these cards into 26. So I'm going to count them in two, so that's two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, and 26. So, like I said, I'm not going to find the card. Before we began, they chosen a black card, okay? And that is a, a free choice of black card. That black card is going to locate the selection. I haven't seen the selection, and you can see how close we are. Let's go slow. Let's go dramatic. It stops here. One card right here. This is going to be unbelievable because they stopped right next to this card, which should be the six of diamonds. Crazy! It's crazy. It really is. Not just that, though. Bang, boom! They actually found the four aces as well, which is unbelievable. Not just that, though. We've got a black ace here. If there's a black ace here, that means all these cards are black. A red ace here, that means all these are red. A black ace here, that means all these are black. And again, with a red ace, all these are red. That is ridiculous. From a shuffle pack, I don't know. I just think this is crazy. So, guys, don't go anywhere because you need to learn this trick. It is amazing. And it's super easy to do. And you guys will be able to do it straight away. So grab your cards, get a drink, and let's learn. Okay, so here is a tutorial of the effect, guys. So what you need to do is split your cards into reds and blacks, okay? So very easy, just splitting reds and blacks. And when you've done that, what you want to do is make sure you have a black ace on the top and a black ace at the bottom of the black piles. And same with the reds, okay? Make sure you've got a red ace on top and the red ace at the face, okay? Hopefully that makes sense. And that is a setup for the trick. So now you have the setup, okay? And by the way, I have actually, I'm using the Tally Ho blue card for the aces just so you can follow everything. So now you've got your black ace, remember, followed by your black card, and then your black ace. Same with the red. Red ace. Red ace. That goes on top. Okay, so remember, you've got blacks, then reds. So like I said, I've removed the normal aces and replaced it with the blue uh, back card, just so, like I said, you can follow along everything. So now I say I want you to go ahead and pick a card out, okay? Making sure it's in the top 26. So let's say they choose this one and say this is going to be a locator card, the seven of spades. You're going to turn the cards over and I do a fan. Okay, if you cannot fan, do not worry. I'll show you another way you can do this. And you're going to place that seven of spades or that black card between the black and red ace. Okay, it's going to go right in just like so. If you cannot do a fan, all you can do is just spread the cards and say, I'm going to place it between, no, do not say that, do not say I'm going to place it between, say, look, I'm going to place the black card in the center and I'm just holding it with one hand and I'm just placing it inside, just like so, okay? 
So you're just placing it between the two aces. Do not tell them that. Just I'm going to place it somewhere in the center and then close everything up. So now you've got this position. The black card is between the two aces and the bottom half is the red, top half is black. So now you need to force a red card. I usually do a dribble, okay? If you can't dribble the cards, it can be a bit challenging for beginners. I'll show you another way of doing it. But if you can dribble, you shout the word stop, okay? And it will be a red card, obviously. What you do is give them that card, the top card in the left hand to the spectator. Your right hand pile goes down. That card is gonna go on top of the right hand packet and then the left packet will go on top of that. Okay, so at speed, that will look like this. Just try to do a stop right here. Take a look at the card. Remember it? Got it? Brilliant. I'm going to leave it inside the center of the pack. That's how fair it looks. But let's just say you can't dribble. So you can do this. So I will spread the cards, and that face-up card is like my key card, okay? So I know when I get to that black card, all these are going to be red. So I know when I get to that black card, I go ahead and just point to one, anyone, or pick one out. I know no matter what, it's going to be a red card. So let's say we choose this one. This is the card we're going to use now. I, it's the same thing, but the only difference is I will need to all these cards in my right hand onto the left packet like this. Okay, and then drop them down. I will tell them to look at the card. We'll use this one, the Eight of Hearts. I'll leave it face up as well. Actually, no, I'm not going to leave it face down because you'll be able to see it easier. Uh, no, should we? we'll do it face up. So the eight of hearts, okay, goes into the center and the left hand packet goes on top. Now, that black card, okay, will be near the bottom. Okay, it's not right down to the bottom, but it's near the bottom. So what you want to do is give that a cut, okay, so it comes near the top. Okay, just like so. About 10 or 15 cards. All you have to do is give it one cut. Then from there, you need to split the card into 26. So I'm going to do, I count them in twos, and you're not going to reverse count them. You're just going to count them in your hand like this. So two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, and then split them right there. So now all you're going to do is just deal these cards off. And what this is doing, Okay, it's actually replacing the blacks and the reds into separate piles. Okay, I know it's, cra it's crazy, but in the spectator's eyes, you're looking for the locator card, which we're going to get to, and these are the aces, okay, and the card finds the selection. That would be face down, okay? So we get to these cards, and I was like, look, it's found one card. It should have found the eight of hearts. Now, obviously, these are blue. I've done it blue like you can see. You turn these cards over, snap your fingers, they found the four aces. Now, the trick's done. They, they think the trick is finished. But then you kick them again. If a black ace is there, all these are black cards. If a red ace is here, all the red cards are here. Same with the black ace. Same with the red ace. Just like so. And you've just got another boom. Honestly, guys... This trick is so, so good. Like, I think it's incredible. And now you know this trick. Go and show your friends, go and show your family, and blow their brains. But that, my friends, is a tutorial. Of the okay, effect. that is the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoy the video. A very easy, semi-automatic card trick. Works on itself. You find the selection, then you find four aces, and then the corresponding colors for the ace of the red and the blacks, match it's just boom 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 it is awesome if you want more tricks like this make sure you leave a comment down below and i can get that sorted for you but like i said that's another video for you guys if you enjoyed it please hit that like and subscribe and also turn the notification bells i'll see you next time